my name is Seth Kweku Bani and today I'm going to show you how to design this. So let's step into the tutorial and then um, control N. Now I'm going to keep the width 2000 and then the height also 2000. We're going to keep it pixels here and the resolution 300 pixels per inch over here as well. RGB color 8 bit black. Let's call it birthday flyer and then let's click on create. Now I want to pull if your wheels are not showing, just control R pull them up for you. Just drag it. I want it to be in the middle. Now the background I'm going to use two particular fill color or solid color. Click on it. And then we are going to use C one six seven seven one. I will click on OK. Then we will go and bring <laughs> this particular one. Guys, I'm going to leave it in the description for you, so you need not to worry. Double click it. For our layer style options to show, let's go to color overlay. Let's click here and let's set the color here to F98. zero nine seven and click on ok click on ok let's give it another solid color and this time we're going to choose a more darker color let's use one six zero nine zero a and click on ok now click over here on the mask over here make sure it's selected go and pick your brush come here and make sure it's color black also make sure here is 100% and then the flow is also 100% go to the brush and choose a soft round brush now make sure your caps lock is also off increase the size a little bit so that we can see it this way and then click over here just keep on clicking until it seems to all right so i think this is quite great let's set the opacity to 85 and this looks quite good I'd like to click one more time okay so this is quite great let's put it in a folder everything in the folder let's call it vg remember we can always come back to work on our background again if you don't like it now let's start with our model so let's drag our model in there as well and then place her somewhere here i believe somewhere here is quite great and then let's call it model now let's also bring our happy birthday png in there drag it somewhere up like this let's increase the size just a little bit okay now pull your ruler here and hit here also pull your ruler here and hit here as well let's hide the rulers so this is how we want it to look like now go back to your background click over here and give it a mask Click on your brush, make sure your caps lock is off. Make sure the mask is clicked and then here's color black and then 100%, 100%. Choose a soft round brush and then clean this side. Okay. You can bring this side a little bit. Okay, so this is quite great. Alright, let's make it 72%. Let's make it 62%. Okay, so it's in there. And that is great let's also click over here and reveal it over here as well now let's put hbd also in a folder let's call it hbd bring our rulers let's type here and then let's pick 
uh, this and then let's paste it there go to your character and then let's pick morganite now let's do some little changes over here we are going to use morganite book for this we are also going to set a font to font size to 40.3 and also the tracking let's make it 20 now duplicate it and bring it down and then let's pick the first name selena paste it there let's send it to the top in fact let's zoom in so that we can be very particular about it let's drag it somewhere here okay let's see this is quite great you want to also bring it down a little bit all right let's call it name and then let's drag it up all right let's close this one now happy birthday i wish happy birthday will go up a little bit more so this is quite great also let's see okay let's the model let's drag the model this side a little bit okay and then let's bring this over here let's drag the name there make sure it touches it great type over here and type 15 15 we are going to use hell vertica and then we are going to use regular here the font size let's use 16 point one one also set the tracking to zero or then the color to color white duplicate it and then let's move it there like that let's pick the month December and then let's paste it there now so let's give December a particular color let's click here let's set it to four one zero two one two and click on ok also pick your rectangular to let's choose the ellipse to rather and then let's hold shift and create a very perfect circle like this drag the circle down the layer down and then drag it here double click it and let's choose this color code 3 b 0 3 1 d click on ok let's zoom in and then let's increase it a little bit just a little bit Let's push the zimmer back also a little bit just like that that's cool now you can put everything in a folder and let's call it date let's push it to the line let's drag it up slightly now let's go and pick our text too i want you to click over here and drag it and drag it down like that sweet now i want you to come here and then pick this detail and then paste it in there okay so let's hit here for everything to disappear like that nice now let's set the font size to 10. we are still using helvetica and then setting the font style to regular and then let's go to the leading you can see that the leading is too much too much space here let's set it to 12. great 
and then the tracking let's set it to zero also let's set it to white here as well and this looks quite great but then we don't want it to be like this and so let's go to paragraph you can see everything is aligned this way and so we can click over here now i'll also like to double click it and then move this here a little bit i want happy birthday to be down here so that would be quite great Control t let me bring this here rather and take click on my move tool and then move this one rather away okay so i'm going to use here as well now um let's see how it looks like in general i want to make sure everything is quite great let's see i i think this is cool so far this so far this is quite cool all right so let's click here and then let's bring the name of the company let's type there and also we are using um railway for this we are setting it to light let's set the font size to 7.35 the tracking let's set it to zero and then let's make it italics also click here let's set it to f f 9 8 b 2 let's click on ok let's bring our lines and then let's also click on our move tool and let's move it okay so this is also quite great now duplicate it and let's bring it somewhere here make sure the italics is off now we are going to use railway style let's set the font style to medium click over here let's set it to black and then let's pick this one is our social media handles drag it in there and then let's resize it now let's drag it here double click it let's change it to color black okay now let's zoom in we want want it to be perfect so okay so i think it's quite great and then let's bring it here like that great 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 okay so let's call this one um let's call it social media and and then let's call this one message message and i think we are done but we are left with one more thing the color grading or the adjustments so click here let's go to gradient map and then click over here now double click here and then let's choose 29 0A59 click on ok also click here and let's choose FF 7C 9 4 great click on ok and then click on ok all right so let's go here let's set it to soft light makes it quite nice and then i think the opacity we need to reduce the opacity too much because it is too much let's set it to 64 all right okay so let's put this let's call it adjustment and ladies and gentlemen this is how you create um, a flyer like this if you love this video please hit the bell icon and subscribe to this channel i love you guys see you in the next tutorial peace